There are four threats in the general ledger and reporting system. First, errors in updating the general ledger and generating reports. This can lead to poor decisions based on incorrect information. Some controls to respond to this threat would be input edit and processing controls, reconciliations and control report, and the audit trail. These are done or implemented in order to double check any errors that may have occurred. Second would be financial statement fraud, which often involves journal entries by upper level management that either overstates revenues or understates liabilities. A control for this threat would be independent testing of all manual journal entries to the journal ledger. The third threat would be the loss, alteration, or unauthorized disclosure of data. This can result in leaks of confidential data or conceal the theft of assets. Some controls for this threat would be to use backup and recovery procedures, utilize access controls, and encrypt sensitive data in storage and in transmission. Lastly would be poor performance. The company may provide tainted or late information to users, may not get internal reports on a timely basis, and could reduce profitability. Controls for this threat would be to prepare and review performance reports, implement XBRL, and redesign business processes. Here are some tools or abilities that are helpful to management decision making. First, the balance scorecard, a report that provides a multi-dimensional perspective on organizational performance. It provides a more comprehensive overview of organizational performance than financial measures alone. Next would be data warehouses, which are typically huge databases that contain detailed and summarized data for a number of years. They are updated periodically to reflect the results of transactions that have occurred since the last update and are purposely designed to be redundant in order to maximize query efficiency. Created using Powtoon.